Good morning, YouTube. Um, we hatched some more chicken eggs. And they're so cute. One of them didn't make it. We think they fell. Come on, come here. Come see the little Aww. black and, Come see the black and white one. Hi, baby. I know. Look it. I can't get them. Hello. So, Mom, they're all different. That one has black spots on the head. Oh, how cute are you? There's another one that's just that color. There's another one that looks just like the bus, yeah. only little. And then there's one more that you well, want to I'm thinking, come well, see. I don't want them to get stuck. Come see, Mom. Come see this. I don't know what to do with you. One of them died because they fell down. Did you grab it already? I already grabbed it. Oh. You want your mama? Well, let's see. There's another one. Mom, I got another one. Oh, see, look I told it. you, look it. Oh, look at how cute you are. Oh, I love little chicks. Because Move sometimes away. they turn ugly, but they're so cute when they're little. So, so there's two more. Well, you're going to have to. Oh, I see the black one. Yeah, I just don't actually cool. freaking out. I'm wondering if we bring them down here. Okay. She's trying to jump up. Yeah, I know. Okay. Maybe. I don't want to. I don't put, think that would be good. I'll be right back. So it's kind of chaotic right now in the backyard trying to get everything situated. We Mama came out of the nesting box um, because we took two of her babies to put them in a box so they wouldn't fall down out of the coop. And then we pulled the other two out, put them in there. She hops in the box with them, tips over the water. Hi, say Absolutely hi, Mom. Insane. You want to say good morning? Say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, we're back. We have a plan now. So Mama jumped in with the um, little baby chicks. I gotta take pictures for my friend. Say hi, Mama. And then we have a little black one. I don't know if you can see it, but she's super protective. So we let the chickens out to roam a little bit, but now they're all kind of fighting over the nesting boxes for some reason. We have to clean out the bottom here. This here is our for the ducks. We're gonna get rid of the ducks. This is what we have to do. This is Cookie. Cookie's our Easter egg. -er. Liam named her Cookie. Because of her color. Because of her color, I guess. She looked like chocolate chip cookie. I think more when she was a baby chick. But, okay. We're gonna get rolling with this and we'll catch you back up later. Okay, we are all sweaty. Zachary's like dripping. We're trying to get, go, put some hay in there. Somebody filled in there with water. Ooh. To cool the ducks off, Ooh. which I wouldn't mind. No, they drank it. They literally are like. They'll drink it, but he saturated the ground. Well, it was like a pool of mud. So I put some hay in there and hope to kind of like, you know, dry it out. I don't know if it's gonna work. Cause they'll drink that water. They'll sit in that water. They're pretty disgusting. So, what? You want to come out this way? She's like, hello. Open the door for me. Excuse me. <laughs> This is Grace. Say hi, Grace. There you go. Pretty genius. My boy. The thinker. <laughs> it takes a while to fill it up, so. Alright. We'll be back. Hopefully we'll be showered and clean. <laughs> Say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, oh. Glary. Yep, glary. Very glary. That's better. <laughs> Good morning. I, we heard you. You've said it like four times now. So we just got done with breakfast. It's for dad's birthday. His birthday was yesterday. But he had to work. Oh, don't forget to check your email. Check your email. So, we're full from breakfast. It was yummy. So dad is at a trail life event uh, thing, meeting, whatever you call it. Yes. About an hour away. So I'm he is gone at. all day. So we're heading out to Walmart. I'm hoping it's that we go, we we're get going there. To the world. So we're going to head there and hopefully make it there before it gets super, super busy because I can't think and I get super stressed out when Walmart is like crazy busy and I have all four kids with me. It's just not a good combination for me. So.
So we're gonna go do that. Hopefully dad's having a good time at Trail Life. Um, for Connecticut, August 1st was the first day that no more plastic bag use. So we have to make sure that we remember and not just going to Aldi, but going to all the stores that we have to bring our own bags or you have to pay for the paper bags. I think it's like 10 cents or something a bag. So instead of doing that, I have plenty of bags. Okay, I made it back from Walmart and I stopped at Stop and Shop. So I just kind of wanted to go over what I got. I wasn't planning on it, but I did find some clearance items at Walmart that I'll show you what I got at Walmart and then I'll show you what I got at Stop and Shop. And I feel like I got a good bang for my buck. Luckily, I didn't have to buy for all six of us this coming week because three out of the four kids are gonna be going to my parents tomorrow and staying the whole week. And so I got to save on that, but I did get some clearance items that we will use, not this week, but maybe another week, which will last us a little while. So. Hey, Milo. Hey, hi. He's like, what'd you buy? What'd you get? What'd you get? Okay, let me show you what I got. Okay, so this is all Walmart. Kick me, Milo. He's in my way. Watch out. So this is everything I got at Walmart. Thanks. This tail just went through the camera. So, and I spent $74 in change on this. But these, these were in the clearance section. So the kids really like the Nature's Bakery. It wasn't a fig bar they tried last time. It was the double chocolate brownie. But I'm assuming these are just like, like Fig Newtons, except raspberry flavored. So I got those. We're not going to eat those this week. We'll probably eat them when the kids are back the week after. Um, these, I don't generally buy box mixes, but the kids like to bake. So I grabbed these. These are $2 a piece. So that was on clearance. And then mac and cheese. This is like the organic mac and cheese. Normally they're $1.42, but for some reason they're on clearance. I mean, there's nothing wrong with them. I don't think they're close to expiring. Not that I could see it on there. But I got four boxes of those on the clearance rack. I got some more pickles on the clearance rack. What else did I get on clearance? Milo, you are just... He's like, here, let me do the video for you today. I think that was pretty much it I got in the clearance rack. I could have grabbed more, but I am on a budget. Yeah, of September. Of this year? Yeah. Oh, okay. So Zach just found that they expired September 22nd, but we will probably use them beforehand. Oh. That's everything I got at Walmart. And the key is to buy Walmart brand stuff because it tastes the exact same as the regular, like, name brand stuff. And you pay, like, a fraction, like a small fraction of the price that they're charging. Because Kayla's not here, normally I don't buy mac and cheese and cheesy things because Kayla can't have dairy right now until she gets her allergy testing done. Yeah. So Zachary requested that I make baked mac and cheese while the kids are gone because he yes. is staying home. So I'm making baked mac and cheese, so I bought a big bag of cheese. I don't need to buy much veggies because one, I don't have as many people and I'm in starting to produce my zucchini, my cucumbers. Hopefully we'll start getting green beans soon. I'm getting plenty of tomatoes. This is what I bought at Stop and Shop. Okay, so this, this is gluten-free mac and cheese. Sometimes if it's on clearance, this is $1.09. Normally $2.19, so I saved 50% on it. My friend's daughters, a couple of them have celiac disease, so they can't have gluten. So sometimes when they come over, I make sure to just have like a small stash of gluten-free items so that if they're eating here or they're here longer than planned, I have something that they can have here. I did find these Fiber One protein bars, which will be good for Steve. These were on clearance, so another key thing, Stop and Shop. I don't know if all of them do it, but the My Stop and Shop has a, usually with their seasonal section, has a like markdown section, like clearance section, and sometimes you can get really good deals, like cans that have a dent in them. Who cares? You're just going to open it and pour it out and cook it anyways. So. Who cares if it's bent? Um, but even boxes, boxes that are like kind of crushed. I'm not that picky. Okay, something's acting funky with it, so hopefully I can get through this. Okay, so these were on clearance at Stop and Shop. I got Captain Crunch. The box was open. The bag is closed, but because the box was open, they mark it down 50%. So I paid a dollar seventy-nine for it. And then like these donut things, the kids have been wanting. 
What? The two dollars, only four dollars. So I, I got those four change. things. I got two loaves of bread, and I got um, seven ears of corn because the corn is twenty cents an ear. And Walmart Superstore was forty cents an ear, and their corn did not look good. I was gonna just buy it there since I was there, but it was worth just stopping off the stop and shop on my way home. So stop and shop, I spent thirteen for the clearance mm -hmm. items. The bread was like more expensive than I wanted and the corn. So overall, I spent less than $100 on all of my items and I'm not gonna need to go back grocery shopping until next week, so or next Friday. So that's what I got. I just wanted to kind of get on it and tell you that. If you wanna see more videos like them or just like separate videos on grocery hauls or, or where to find the deals and stuff, comment below. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to our videos if you haven't yet. Comment below if you're new. We're gonna get on with the rest of our day and finish getting all these groceries put away and we will see y'all later.